Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to get 4 to 6 pieces of steel every 20 seconds. On Ghost of Tsushima, this is the director's cut. I found a lovely location. Just before we start, let me begin by saying these patches, today is the 31st of December 2021. If you're looking at this video in the future and this patch or this farming spot doesn't work, please do not leave negative feedback and abuse and bad comments and stuff. At the time of making this video, this was working. Sony or the makers of Ghost of Tsushima might patch this up and they might fix it with a new update and then you might not be able to farm again. So I'm just going to come out and show you. This is on the top island. I tried another glitch and I unlocked, I believe, this one, Pillar of Honor, or it was Marsh Rock Shrine. And I fast traveled to here. And you can see at the bottom there, press triangle, fast travel. And then from one of those places, I rode the horse all the way down. And on the way, I passed this survivor camp, which is a new fast travel, which is going to help me in the future. And then you want to come to this area. You see, I'll zoom in. It says Urashima's village. village, Urashima's village. And you see these three little islands, two islands here. And you want to come and set your marker just about there, just below. Okay, so you got old Toyotama Hills, cushy grasslands, and come to over here. Okay, so let's go in there now. Koshimizu Farmstead. Here you can farm five steel and keep repeating and doing this. There is lots of absolutely lots of supplies here and each time you unlock one of these boxes you get uh, supplies anything from 12 up to 25 i've seen there is mongols around here but stay off this path so that's where they come from and they're patrolling they go into the village a little bit or this um, farmstead um, but mainly they stay on the main road and I've, i haven't had to fight them not even once so you can go and leave your horse under that little hut or if you want to you can take it around here and i'll give you some reference points there's two chests and they're separated by about 15 seconds of running so i'm going slow just to show you guys you can do both chests in less than 20 seconds so there's your first chest i'm gonna get off the horse now let me give you some reference see that little hut there just have a look, there's the waterfall behind me. There's a little campfire. And you're gonna open this chest. And I'll do it quick a lot next time, just giving you a thorough. So there's three steel. Turn 180 degrees and run through these two buildings. You can stay on the path where you might encounter Mongols. So go behind here. On purpose, I'm going slow so you guys don't get lost come through this bamboo and you see this big burnt down building diagonally cut through there and this is the director's car and like i said 31st of december 2021 is still working and then you got another two and watch after the so got three still got six this time so you get minimum five 19 supplies as well absolutely fantastic when i came the very first time there was some steel on this here as well but it doesn't respawn everything else a lot of it respawns now if you have a look around these huts and places there is lots of linen and other supplies as well i'm mainly after steel at the moment to upgrade my blade so let's go so go over to options restart x to say yes and we're back here so we're going to go fast this time let's go just want to show you the speed you can go at oh went too much i leave my horse in here and run there's a chest get it come on come on come on ah lost a couple of seconds there there's two run 
do the stay off the path, go behind, up here, through these bamboos, there's the burnt down building. Now I didn't show you enough reference for this building. Let me show you after I collect guys. And like I said, there's loads of supplies around and you can keep farming this over and over again. So you see it works. Now, this location, there's only one big burnt down building here. Have a look at that building there with right angles to it. Look like a samurai sword on top of the roof. So just have a look. So mainly this building is your reference. And then, or oh, restart checkpoint there and let's go again just show you one more time just to show you that it does work now there's a mongol over there if you're quick and quiet they don't even bother seeing you that's two steel and go So that was really good. So I managed to show you the Mongols not interfering. They're nearby, but you know, there's another little hack for that as well. So uh, there's the burnt building. Go to the left or the right. I prefer to go there because it's more hidden. Over this little ash pile and three, two. So this time gave me four, two in each one and 16 supplies. So just over his head, you can see the burnt building there. And the other small one is just behind his head right now. And you see that little island there? It doesn't respawn. The first time you come here, I would say swim over to this little bamboo island, tiny. You can just swim from anywhere, it's absolutely fine. And there's a good, good stash of supplies there. But it does not respawn, so no point going back. How beautiful is this? What a game. Okay, let's call my horse. Hi, horsey. Just stay here and I'll show you my horse. So this is the deluxe horse, extra horse that came and it's available for people who paid for the deluxe or the director's cup version has this one. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on another video real soon. Bye for now.